Li Minho gained widespread fame around the world after he portrayed Gu Jun Pio in the 2009 hit K-drama series Boys Over Flowers. Not only did it help him become a household name as it also earned the 34-year-old Asian superstar the Best New Actor Award at the 45th Bexang Arts Awards. Sealbeat reported that Li Min Ho has a net worth of $10 million in 2021. Other reports claim that the rumored boyfriend of former Momoland member Yin Wu has a total net worth of $26 million this year. Hi guys, this is GHB and welcome to my YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, share, and comment to my uploaded videos. And thank you for watching. See you there. Lee Min Ho got most of his earnings from his appearance on Boys Over Flowers, Personal Taste, City Hunter, The Heirs, and The King, Eternal Monarch. The latest project of the K-drama actor, reportedly, grossed around $135 million. Lee Min Ho got most of his earnings from his appearance on Boys Over Flowers, Personal Taste, City Hunter, The Heirs, and The King, Eternal Monarch. The latest project of the K-drama actor, reportedly, grossed around $135 million. It comes as no surprise that Lee Min Ho is one of the wealthiest South Korean stars of his generation as he is also the most followed K-drama actor on social media. As if that's not enough, the ex-lover of Suzy Bae was also the first Korean artist to have a wax figure in his image at Madame Tussauds with figures being revealed in 2014 in Hong Kong and in 2013 in Shanghai, China. It was also claimed that Lee Min Ho earned a whopping $2.5 million product endorsements alone. The Hallyu superstar is, currently, the brand ambassador of Promise, Domino's Pizza, and Cell Return LED Mask, alongside Park Seo Joon and Kong So Ra. He was also tapped to endorse Lottie Duty Free, Etude House, and Kia Motors before. Lee Min Ho is said to be richer than Song Jung Ki, Hyun Bin, Lee Seung Ji I, and Gong Yu. However, Kim Soo Hyun, So Ji Sub, and Lee Jong Suk remained the top three richest and wealthiest Korean actors in 2021.